Hey, this is Rich. I was pretty bored today, so I thought I'd try to build a, a heater. A lot of people saying they can't afford downspouts or they're having a hard time putting their pop cans together. So I thought I'd try to come up with the cheapest, easiest way to make one. And I did this one, and it's uh, no drilling, no wood, no nothing. And it's just loose pop cans, no hose cut in them or nothing. They're just lined up in there with a piece of screen holding it. And I just put it out here about 15 minutes and I do have a thermometer down in there I don't know if, I don't know if that's gonna see that but it's reading can't tell it's reading 117.5 now it's been out here 15 minutes and don't have any headers or anything so I'm gonna let it go here a little bit and let's see what it does then I'll show you how I made it alright I got this piece of glass here well it's not glass it's plastic and what I'm doing I built me a little box right here just out of uh, insulation it's half inch foil backed so my glass will set down in there and I just uh, duct taped it together you can see it and then I'm just gonna seal around all the corners and let it dry okay I use that high heat mortar that I always use I just sealed up, sealed up the cracks there inside the box. Okay, this box, I knocked my hose. There are not going to be any headers in it. And I use cage wire right there for my intake. And I just take a piece of, um, piece of wire right here, and then you just, you know, bend it over to make your, um, circular, um, part. And there I put them both in and I um, on the bottom I left left a little bit coming out a couple inches so you can um, attach your uh, hose to it. Okay and all I'm doing is uh, I'm, uh, I'm just laying the cans in there. No hose cut out or nothing. Just laying them in. I put a row across and a row down. Okay I uh, laid my cans down in there. What I did, I just used this uh, mesh wire like I used on the bottom hose to help hold the cans in there because you know, everything's loose. And I put, um, I just added a little extra piece on here to help hold it down. I put a, little, a couple little screws in there. Just hand screwed them. I don't even need a screwdriver. It's so easy. And I'm just going to lay the glass in there and seal it up. Okay, here it is. <clears throat> I laid my plastic. I put a bead of um, the high heat mortar around the edges, and I dropped it in there. And then I sealed it here with the uh, handyman secret weapon duct tape, just all the way around. So the whole thing is um, done. We'll just try to test it, and it's light as a feather. So we'll just see. Okay, it's been about a half hour. And let me see, it's at one, I don't know if you can see that, it's at 142.7. And that is some good temperature. And there's only like, I think like 46 cans in there. And on the back here, oh, I got good, good hot airflow. So this whole thing, I mean, it, it doesn't weigh nothing. I mean, I can, I can pick it up with one hand. So that just uh, goes to show, you know, you can use anything you have available, I think. As long as you make you a box and you put some metal in there. And now, uh, you know, I didn't take my time on this one. I was just wanting to experiment. I mean, it's doing great. I mean, it's, that's doing great temperatures. So anyways, I still got a little bit of sun. I'm going to let it go and just see if it gets any higher than that, if it shuts the temperature thing down. Okay, um, that's about it. That thermometer thing, it shuts down at 144, so it's at 144 now. And it's been just about a half hour. Oh, my oven thermometer that I put in there. Look at that thing. It's at just almost 170 degrees. Jeez. That's amazing. I've been doing all this work. Putting all them cans and stuff together. Now this is... I never would have believed this. Well, that's about it. 
and I am truly amazed that you could get that kind of temp out of just something like this. So simple. So, I'm actually glad I took some videos. I almost didn't, because I really didn't think it would work. I just wonder what would, wonder if you could put, um, if you smashed pop cans and put in there, I wonder what it would do. I don't know, I may try that. But anyways, if you want to build a cheap one, this is the way to go. I cannot believe it. Thanks for watching.